everyone. My name is Robert, and I'm going to shoot a 300 grain Hornady XTP out of my Rossi in 45 long colt. This is loaded over a pretty stout charge of Winchester 296, same as Hogden H110. Uh, 300 grain XTP, real stout load. I'm going to fire it into 10 water jugs and see what kind of expansion and penetration we get. Hopefully it only goes through five or six and I get to shoot my 45 ACP into the other one. I would say that was a thorough, a thorough destruction of the water jugs. Let's see. I numbered all the jugs. This is jug number one, and it looks pretty destroyed. Jug number three also destroyed. I'll write it down. And here we have a through and through on jug number four. It's kind of low. Hole. Jug number five. Uh oh. Looks like I'm not testing 45 ACP. Jug number two is flattened completely, open all the way up. Let's hope it's jug number six. Get a bolt, hopefully. Number seven. Jug number six. We have a hole. And we have a bullet. All right, fantastic. Let's cut into jug number six. Let's see what we find. Do some hood of the truck jug surgery. Here we have a 45 long colt plus P, 300 grain Hornady XTP. It's probably going about 1,590 feet per second. That's what it was doing the last time I chronographed this load. Uh, sometimes it hits 1,600, but rarely. It feels like it weighs about 280 grains or so. It's still pretty heavy. I'll weigh it and put that on the uh, video description. But there you go. 45 Colt can do some damage out of a little Rossi R92 or Winchester 92. Thanks for watching.